Good morning. Good morning. Happy birthday. Good morning. I'm now 30 years old. <laughs> You don't feel 30? I don't feel 30. <laughs> but I am 30 years old. I know. You like my, uh, well, you made this for me. It's a scarf. <laughs> <laughs> so what we did, what I did for Yara's birthday, I never shared it, but I did a countdown. He got to open a present every day, starting on the beginning of his birthday month. And then the finale was today. And I put this in there with what we're doing. And we're going glamping. It's like really bougie tents. It's really interesting. So we'll take you guys along. It's called Under Canvas. Under Canvas Acadia. Yeah, it looks really cool. So I'm excited. I can't wait for the night. I'm the stars. And I'm just so excited. I think our tent has a stargazer, like where you can look up from the bed and it has a mosquito no. net. Yeah. So we'll take you guys along. It's going to be pretty fun. Wow. Time to celebrate your birthday, darling. Thank you, my love. Happy 30th. This man's 30. My husband is 30. All right, we just packed. Yara's in the shower. Um, I have some snacks for the road. Smart food. Yara's favorite. Yara's favorite. Yara's favorite. Um, grapes, pineapple, and yeah, it's like a four hour drive, maybe a little longer. So this should last us through our trip and on the way back too, but snackies. And then I also have like cupcakes. And like a candle, like candles and stuff to surprise him tonight at the hotel or the tent. <laughs> All right, we are ready. Let's rock. Here we go. But first we have to stop and have breakfast. We hungry. Sharing some pancakes. Capture. Another state to go. Wait, one state or two states? Is it above Vermont or next to Vermont, babe? <laughs> Maine. I think it goes like this. Oh, do we go through Vermont or no? Uh, no. No? Okay. So one more state to go. <laughs> we still have uh, three more hours. It's only been an hour and a half. We're almost halfway there, kind of. Stopped and got some matcha. I like a third of the way there. Shut up. <laughs> okay, well, it's a four, four and a half hour ride and we only have three hours left. So yeah, we're like a third of the way there. <laughs> What'd you say? About your strawberry acai thing, how, how do you mask your matcha? Uh, I think I've told them this, but yeah. oh, but I did up the ante today. So I, Yara put me on to matcha way back when we started dating. Um, I also just touched that pimple, so don't look at it. But um, he put me on to adding matcha. He does like a matcha lemonade, but he does four scoops in a grande. <laughs> so crazy. So I do three scoops. Well, I used to do two scoops, but now I do three in my venti strawberry acai refresher. You cannot taste it at all. It totally masks the matcha and it's like still really good. And it gives you great energy. So three scoops in a venti if you don't want to taste the matcha. If you want to taste the matcha, four scoops in, in a grande. grande. <laughs> okay guys, we made it to Maine. We are like 45 minutes, right babe? From yeah. the campsite, That's so. 39. Okay, not bad. So like 30, 40 minutes away. I ended up just falling asleep for like two hours. So I did not get the we're in Maine moment. Oopsie, but Yara was listening to a good podcast. Um, now we're stopping to refill our gas, pick up some water for the night. We brought our hydro flasks. Um, so we just filled those up with some cold water. Um, we have more in the car. We don't really know what to expect with this because um, I mean, I haven't really told you guys that much about it yet but it's, um, these tents are made of canvas. They're super, like, li they're like little rooms. They have like deluxe ones that are like little houses even, but we have like a deluxe room and it has like a bathroom. It's, they're super cute. It's on the water. It looks really fun. It's raining today and tomorrow though, which is kind of like a bummer, but that's okay. Uh, I have a couple activities planned, so it, it's gonna be really fun. It is. So I'm excited. We're almost there and, uh, Let's see how it is. Birthday boy is killing the drive. I'm really happy I have a husband who doesn't mind driving. So we're almost there and it just started pouring. Pouring rain. We got no service. We have no service. Um, 
<laughs> I don't know how this uh, tent situation goes with the rain, so let's uh, see how that goes. Where do you enter? I was gonna enter that driveway <laughs> there. Box. Okay. I'm like low-key spooked. <laughs> low-key spooked my gooped. <laughs> but excited. Found the registration. So there's like little pockets of these tents and like individual parking lots for each section. Oh, look at the little pop cats! Oh my god, this is so cute. I'm so oh, I'm so excited. This is adorable. This is adorable. Oh my gosh. So yeah, I love how they did it. They have parking lots not only here, but in different numbers. Different little sections. Like, like neighborhoods. Yeah, know? I didn't record it, but like it was like tents number one through twenty parking lot here, and then you go down a path. So we'll right. show you guys. Oh my god, it's so cute. This is so cute. They just gave us a tour. They have complimentary hot cocoa. Uh, tea, water, um, coffee all the time. This is their little restaurant. They have dinner and breakfast. Got a picture of the menu. And then out here, they have complimentary s'mores every night. Um, when it's weather permitting. And they have like giant Jenga, they have games. And then this is the view of the water. He said it's really beautiful and it's clear. Like you can see the mountains over there. Um, Acadia, <laughs> you know, this is where we are. But it looks like it's gonna be so, so much fun. They have activities every night, um, like bingo, uh, pumpkin painting. I'm like swooning. This is the cutest thing in the whole world. So we were just down at the registration and the parking lot is like super, super far from our tent. And he was so nice. He was like, let me see if you can park at your tent. We're the only people who got to park at our tent. So this is our car. That's our tent. Okay, let's not even get our stuff. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Tent tour. Is this cinematic mode? I don't think so. Does it look cinematic? Yeah. We got the new iPhone and it like is crazy the pictures and video is crazy so i always upgrade for you guys because i want like better quality if i vlog on my phone okay so here's it i wonder if any of our neighbors are here this place my heart is like so excited this is so cute all right let's go inside so first we have this um led light he told us there's a switch on the side I also want to film a TikTok. We'll do it again after. This is some thick canvas. This is like the one we had at our wedding. We were all worried about whether the rain was going to be a problem. It's not. What the heck? Oh my god. This is stunning. It has that good smell too. Woodsy. That smells woodsy super smell. woodsy. Oh my god. And I love it here. Like they're like. Uh, they have no Wi-Fi. They're like, this is time to connect. They have board games. Like, they're all about, like, reconnecting with nature. How... Look at this bathroom. This is so nice. Look at the sink. Wow. And, like, one of their things is they all, like, all the furniture is from West Elm. It's like, this is so glam. <laughs> I love that the shower, too, it's like a pull one, so you can serve more water. Oh. Which is cool. This is so bougie, I'm dying. Oh, we got storage here. Oh, extra pillows and blankets. That's nice. And the guy taught us how to start our fire. Um, <laughs> let's, you wanna try to start it, babe? Or you wanna do it later? Not yet, we're kinda hungry, aren't we? True. Um, here's our bed. Towels, and he taught us how to use our lanterns. Our little mini fan. They give you USB. A little light to bring to the bathroom. <laughs> Did you notice they had a little hook in the bathroom so you can like carry your lantern to the bathroom? <laughs> um, and a USB too, so. I have this cute little sitting area. Little leather couch. Pretty comfortable. It's so quiet. <laughs> oh my god. It's pretty quiet. No lights neither. 
No, it's gonna get dark soon. We gotta turn on our little lanterns. <laughs> so this is the room tour. It's nice. All right. Um, Thanks, Bob. So we're gonna. You're welcome. We're gonna unpack and figure out what to do for dinner because we didn't have lunch. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see it, but like for spooky season, this is not like from them, but there's a perfect spider web right here. Can you guys see it? <laughs> like it's like the perfect spider web. We're off to dinner. Okay, so it's been very hard to find a restaurant because it's Saturday night and like nowhere really took reservations, but Hi. how are you? Um, but they have really fun fall cocktails here I kind of want to try. Apple cider margarita, are you kidding? Ooh, this all sounds really good. So we're at a place called Finn's, not Flynn's. So thankfully we got a table. All right, we got, oh my God, the quality. Oh my, you're gonna die. The quality on this phone, and, and it's like really dark in here. Um, we got the apple cider margarita. Yara and I are gonna share it because we literally hardly drink. All right, give it a try, babe. Let's get that first reaction. It has like sugar on the rim. I don't know how it's gonna be. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you like it? Mm -hmm. All right, let me try. Ooh, dude, that's so weird. It tastes genuinely like apple cider and a margarita. Cause I can taste the tequila a little bit. Ooh. Mm. Oh my god, that's so good. Good morning. <laughs> This hair tells pretty much everything you need to know about the sleep situation. But look how cute. This is our little lantern for the bathroom. It's like you carry it and you hang it up here. Can you guys hear the rain? Oh my god. So I'm going to test this um, pulley shower. <laughs> pulley shower. Where is... Okay, so here is the cord to pull it. Um, all right, cool. So we're, we're gonna shower and we're gonna go to breakfast and then I'll tell you guys how the first night went. All right, we're heading out to get breakfast and then we're going on a bus tour of Acadia today. Fabletics, Fabletics. I love my Fabletics. It's nice and cool. Oh my God, it feels so nice to like actually be in fall-like weather. And up here in Maine, the leaves are so beautiful like they're way more turning over to the foliage than in mass right now i think they turn earlier up here but it's very rainy but uh the next two days are supposed to be sunny which is great so yeah, look at the harbor. <laughs> i just got you going yay look at the harbor yay. <laughs> we're driving to breakfast we're eight minutes away and then we have our Oh, little harbor. Then we have our bus tour. So tell them about last night. <laughs> you could sh** me too if you want. Well, th this is your first camping experience, right? Yeah. There's no privacy. <laughs> There's no... <laughs> I didn't think about that. I genuinely... I'm so stupid. I did not think about the fact that there's zero privacy when you're camping. And people are like 10 feet away from you. <laughs> zero privacy. Maybe 20 feet. And, uh... We heard a lot of things and it <laughs> kept you up. I was going crazy. Nothing R rated or, or nothing like that, but it was just like you're used to, you know, sleeping with a white noise machine. Yeah. The rain held, but okay, it was on yeah. and off. I'm so sorry. Acadia okay, National Park. Okay, continue. The, the uh, rain held, but it was on and off. Um, but you couldn't sleep. Meanwhile, I was sleeping like a baby. <laughs> And you just kept tossing and turning. <laughs> and, but it's not tossing and turning, but very sporadic. You're very, like, like just... I'm erratic. My, my, my sleeping is erratic when I can't sleep. Is like, I, I toss and turn, I erratic, toss and turn. Really? Yeah, sporadic means, like, it happens infrequently. Oh, really? Yeah, like an event happens randomly. Okay. Erratic is like a like cuckoo. Well, that sounds like erotic, and it doesn't sound like the right thing to say. <laughs> it's not erotic! Yeah, I could your girl could not sleep. Um, and then eventually, like, because we had the mesh opening up behind the bed so we could get, like, fresh air. So we ended up closing that. But you could just, it's just like, I'm just like murmuring, like, nin, 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 murmuring and, like, I don't know. It sounded like they were building furniture at midnight. 
Like, what are y'all doing so, at midnight? Around midnight, you start Googling, you know, what do quiet hours mean? I'm like, and your cat's keeping me up, like, hey, hey, <laughs> this is waking me up. <sighs> really? I'm like, who are you talking to? Oh, a couple like, times. Yeah, yeah exactly. twice I so, went, oh my. God. Yeah, I'm, yeah, you're right and I'm here, like, dude. Who are you talking to? You're not asking me up. So That's true. That's true. <laughs> I guess I thought you were asleep enough to like not hear me. <laughs> oh, I just like it literally sounded like they were building furniture in the middle of the night. So we woke up super late to watch the Formula One race. And super tired. <laughs> three laps left, which was a crazy three laps. Oh, it was amazing. But poor Lando. Yeah. And now we're on our way to breakfast. Yeah. And we are hungry. But we woke up super late because we didn't sleep. We woke up late. We're tired. It's almost noon, but we're going to get brunch. Um, and the brunch place we're going to is right next to the bus tour, which is perfect. So we're going down. It's so This is what's up. We're staying in a town called Surrey, which is like near um, Acadia. You can see the national park from our hotel, which I showed you guys. It's like across the lake. But like this is Bar Harbor. Um, which is the more like poppin' area around um, Acadia. This place is poppin'. So this is where like all the restaurants are and stuff. We're going down to like the main street. Um, so it's not that it's raining. Yeah, it's, it's slightly killing the vibe, but right. that's okay because the next two days are going to be sunny. Yeah, and we're going to be driving down here every day. So maybe on Monday when it's like the sun's out. Yeah, we'll vlog more Five tomorrow days. too when it's better, and we have very fun activity planned for tomorrow which you guys will see in the morning oh this is adorable two cats what's that two cats two it's a cats restaurant and bar dog. two cats restaurant and pub. this is giving me p-town energy oh look at the foliage guys stunning stunning it's stunning cute little shops around the outside around the outside ba, ba, ba. this is like the most we've seen since we got here wow. Oh. Bikes, canoes. Canoes. See, the street signs are important. Oh, they're cute. Yeah, this is definitely like the area. So cute. So cute. They have a North Face. Little oh. theater. Oh. Get a rain jacket. Yeah, we need to get you a rain jacket. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, I love it here. It's a cute restaurant. So the breakfast place had an hour and a half wait. So we're at a place getting a lunch, which is fine, but it's actually really cute, so it worked out. Yara's grabbing some coffee before we go. Yeah, I have the tickets. All of Bar Harbor, all because of that island straight ahead of us. That's Bar Island. There is a sandbar that attaches that island to this one here, and that is the reason why in 1918, at a town meeting, they made a decision to change the name from the town of Eden to the town of Bar Harbor. Nobody had more money than Rockefeller. Uh, those people are totally wrong. Totally this wrong. guy is such a vibe. <laughs>
Yeah, I'm in a shock that I got beer, but it's really not beer. It's it's just hard cider and it's pumpkin. I've never had it, so um, our bus tour was phenomenal. We're back at our hotel, getting dinner outside with the sunset. Next, we'll go to the little fires. You want to tell them what happened? So I left my phone on the bus. <laughs> We were scared, so we were chasing. So we opened up the Find My app, and we were chasing my phone through the Find My app. We were chasing this guy. The bus driver, because that was his last tour the of the driver, day. The last tour of the day, he was parking the bus. I don't know somewhere, and um, we followed him. Find, find My iPhone, phone, but we followed him. It was kind of, it was like chasing somebody. It was kind of crazy. It was hilarious. Yeah, um, we found it, but it's so unlikely to leave my phone behind. We had the best bus tour though with um santo he's the sweetest guy if you ever need to do an acadia like part tour yeah like that was he was a peach amazing funny too very funny I swear he does comedy on the side he was hilarious i loved he him he has that dad energy though yeah he was the best <laughs> cold tonight guys so we're gonna do a fire we just played cards for like an hour it was super nice last night it was a little too hot for a fire it wasn't hot but it wasn't cold tonight it's really chilly so dinner here was amazing by the way guys absolutely delish oh. <laughs> ah! i wish i had recorded that rant good morning it's the next day so when we stopped to get breakfast the other day, we had a funny moment. So Yarman wanted chocolate chip pancakes and he ordered a side of pancakes with his breakfast. And um, <laughs> he goes, he's like, um, oh, can I get chocolate chips on, on the pancakes? And then they literally put chocolate chips on the pancakes. Cause that's like, that's what he said, but he just wanted chocolate chip pancakes. <laughs> like, should I have side of chocolate chip? Or can I have pancakes with chocolate chips? In them, like, should I be explicit? Like, I, I, I don't know. In them? Well, like, I guess she wasn't wrong. I said on them, but like, still, like, who has chocolate chip? Who has pancakes with chocolate chips on them as opposed to in them? It's a problem. I thought it was so funny. And now um, we're on our way to breakfast, and he, I was just like, "So, what are you gonna get for breakfast today?" He's like, "Well, for the pancakes, I'm gonna clarify. I want them in." But I was like. You know what you'd probably just say is like, oh, can I make the pancakes chocolate chip? Like you don't have to say in them or on them. I'm gonna say I want chocolate chip pancakes. There is, you go. Is, is that clear enough? That's precise. All right, I hope so. <laughs> it's iconic. So we slept really well last night, feeling rejuvenated. Oh my god, it was like winter last night. I sleep really. Ooh, pretty view. It's cold. Pretty. Um, I sleep really well when it's cold. Um, so I slept, slept really well. We just, we snuggled and stayed nice and warm. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go have breakfast, do a little, like, walking around that downtown Bar Harbor area, because it's so cute. Um, check out the little shops and all that, because we didn't get to yesterday, because we went on the hunt for this man's phone. <laughs> and then we are going, we didn't tell them what we're doing it today. We are going on... A scenic flight. Ooh. Scenic flights of Acadia, baby. It's literally like a three passenger plane, and we're gonna go uh, on a tour on a plane. So it's gonna be super fun, and uh, we'll take you along. But right now, we're hungry. It's like 11 o'clock, so let's go have some breakfast. Yeah. Have a Cute. There's a wait for breakfast, so we're. Looking at stuff. You gotta get a sweatshirt, you know? Ooh. Look at this. Oh, my mom is calling. Okay, we are at Jeannie's Great Main Breakfast. Um, I don't think I'm gonna get it, but stuffed pumpkin pancakes. Are you kidding? Okay, I'm gonna put my phone away. <laughs> now we are gift shopping before our flight, getting some gifts for people. 
I love it in here. Okay, maybe we should have waited. <laughs> maybe we shouldn't have bought it. They have so much cute stuff in here. So much cute stuff. Chris, ooh, babe, a Christmas tree candle. That's all you. That's all me. Maple pumpkin butter. Stonewall Kitchen has good stuff. Ooh, condensed. How do you do this? So there's a popcorn place over here. I wanted to grab some popcorn from. Let's see what they got. Which one is your favorite? My favorite? Yeah. Uh, the salt sweet? Is it like a kettle corn? Yeah? Uh, but the caveat is the caramel is very good. Yeah? Got some popcorn. Oh, yeah. We'll try later. Cheddar. Cheddar better. They also had blueberry, but we're more of salty popcorn eaters than sweet for the most part. Yeah, I was going to say, let's get more than one flavor, but they're $11 a tub. So. <laughs> it's a lot of popcorn for yeah. two people. <laughs> so now we're just poking around Main Street until the, hel the helicopter, the airplane. If you guys have never been here and you're in New England, it's really cute. This is both of our first times and Bar Harbor is the cutest, cutest town. Ice cream. Ice cream. And it's on the water, um, but it has like just the cutest small town energy. Everyone is so nice, but it's kind of big too. It's great. Oh my God, guys, Christmas vacation shop. Okay, well, <laughs> make my day, why don't you? <gasps> this is what dreams are made of. I love Christmas stores. Christmas shop was mildly disappointing, but it's okay. <laughs> That's because nothing will beat the, um, what is that place called? The Christmas shop? Um, in North Conway. Yeah, that one is amazing. Yeah. So now I always expect that. It's gonna be hard to beat. Yeah. I think we just have time for this last shop and then we're gonna head over. Ooh, that's a nice mug. It is a nice mug. Wow, I love the different texture. Right. Yeah, I'm in this image. <laughs> so we just got to the flights, the scenic flights of Acadia. And Yarmin's like, I'm like, I told him I'm getting a little anxious. And he's like, just take it slow. And I'm like, what do you mean take it slow? And he's like, this is what you would do. Passengers, <laughs> buckle your seatbelts. Okay. <laughs> Bubba, it's not, it's not fitting. It's not, hey, it's not fitting. Hey, 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 it's not funny. Take a deep breath. And then click. Just look at where you're putting the seatbelt. Look at the buckle. Align it softly and click. Not, it's not working. Maybe you have it backwards. This is me in a nutshell, guys. I really, I panic and I go really fast. It's my anxiety. It's okay. It's all good. Let's have a fun flight. Yeah, it'll be fun. Let's go. Oh, it's a perfect day for it, y'all. This is crazy. Our guy just went to use the bathroom. Oh my god. He's running. He's running. Oh, buddy. Everyone here is already so nice. But like, here we go, y'all. I'm in the back. Yara's in the front. This is teeny. My claustrophobia is screaming. <laughs> this is good. This is a good experience for me to be out of my comfort zone. There you go. Learning to be fearless. <laughs> The plane ride was awesome, but we both got a little sick. 
So if you ever do anything like that, definitely take Dramamine. But overall, an amazing experience if you're in Acadia. I put makeup on because it's cool. Um, we came back here to chill before we go to dinner. Um, you know, just one little piece of glam. Probably the only time I'll do makeup while we're here. Uh, but we are going to go down and have some dinner back in Bar Harbor and just enjoy, enjoy the evening. So let's go. Okay, we're at dinner. I'm having shrimp scampi. Yara got chicken parm. This looks really, really good. Alex is enamored by a big spider. It's really big. Damn, it won't focus. It won't. It's huge, though. I'm sorry, I forgot. Got ice cream. What'd you get? Mint Oreo. He loves mint Oreo. A raggle. And like they had other cool flavors. He's like, if they don't have mint Oreo, I'm gonna get that. <laughs> but no, wants the mint Oreo. It was maple walnut. <laughs> Did I have the maple walnut? I was gonna get the coffee heat. Did I have that? I'm out. <laughs> That's it. They have free masks, and we're chilling by the fountain. Good morning. We're gonna go watch the sunrise. <laughs> we're trying to be super. So the sunset was a little, sunset, sunrise was um, a little bit of a fail only because it was cloudy, but we still had a really nice time. Yara got coffee, I got some hot chocolate, and we just sat and looked at the water, took showers, and now we are heading to breakfast, and it's only 7.30, so we've got the whole day ahead of us. Let's go. It looks like I saw people buying this when they were leaving. I feel like the, that's like their most popular thing, the muffin. That's what they're known for. Okay, so our breakfast came with the muffins. Oh my God, looks really good. So Yara is gonna give us a live review. Well, it's not live, but he's gonna give us a review. Shane's all about the wild blueberries, right? The wild blueberries. Not really good. good? I wish it was warmer. Yeah. But it's really good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Chocolate chips inside. Wanna show them? Yeah, buddy. That's it. Alright, so we have some time to kill, so we are gonna drive through the park um to some other parts that we didn't get to see on the bus tour. Canadian National Park. We got the sunroof open. It's a vibe. Oh, fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Oh my God, it's popping. That's the visitor center. One thing I'll say is, we, we thought it was like gonna just be busy on the weekend. It has been so busy 24 seven. 24 seven. <laughs> Even the breakfast place we went to today, uh, early, it was yeah, packed. There was still a wait. So like, Acadia, I think is just popping 24 seven. I don't know, probably not in the winter, but you know, we thought we'd kind of be between like the summer period and fall because we're not at peak foliage yet, but a lot of RVs. This made us, um, like going glamping, this made us want to like do RV life because like I will say the tents are awesome and we love our experience that we're having, no but there's no privacy at all. <laughs> you hear everything. I'm gonna turn around. I think I went the wrong one. Okay. We're a little bit lost. What is the authorized vehicle number? Carriage road. Is, I think this is just where people park. It's the visitor center. For people who want to hike, yeah. I'm not trying to do trails. I'm just trying to drive around. <laughs>
took a little stop. Is this something you don't see every day, huh? No, I love it. Um, so we're on, we're in, we're just driving around exploring, and we're in a place called Northeast Harbor instead of Bar Harbor. Oh wow, <laughs> amazing. Oh, there's a stop next harbor. There's a lot of harbors. A lot of harbors. Harbor. Oh, I love it. It's so quiet. I feel the need to whisper. Got some nice foliage. I thought I'd show. Like little, little bursts like this. Pretty. Look how far we are, guys. From the National Park. Our harbor is all the way over here, and we've been venturing around through the park, and now we're all the way on the other side. Yeah. All right, y'all got a hat. Oh, this is comfortable. That looks good. Yeah. I like it. Cool. Let me see the front. Very cute. And I got a sweatshirt and a shirt for fifteen dollars. Great deal. Look at we found some turkeys. Hi, turkey. All right, y'all, we're heading back to our tent to pack up and head home. And honestly, this was so much fun. Like, really cool experience. Hopefully you guys can see, like, that's our tent. There's the water, there's the Acadia mountains across. Very cool. We're packing up and I just found my beauty, <laughs> my beauty sponge on the, on the table. So gotta grab this. But I put on my new Bar Harbor sweatshirt, super cute. Fabletics shorts, super comfy for the long ride home. But we had a really fun trip. This was definitely a cool experience. Thank you for my thirty. I'm glad you enjoyed it. It was fun. We had a good time. I'm an outdoorsy person. Yeah. I'm glad we you need had to do more time. of it. That's great. Our first time glamping. Yar has camped, but he's never glamped. So I'd say this was really fun. If you're looking into glamping, they do have um under canvas locations in other national parks, but it's really, really fun. Can't wait to get home and edit this vlog because I feel like it's gonna be really fun to edit. Um, all right, Yara packed us up, off we go. See you later.